another video, you know. I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. But before we continue, you know, hit that like button and subscribe. Bing. You know, you know. Alright, so today I'm going to show y'all how to style these locks. Yes, I know it's a month old, but you can still style them, but, you know, I'm taking them out after this. Not gonna lie, I'm gonna take it out, but just wanted to show you, there's a lot of styles you could do with this that are looking like this, all blurring in. So, you know, there's quite a few styles that you could do. The styles that I'm going to be doing are my favorite styles. I mean, there's a lot more you could do, but... I don't want to do those. I want to do the ones that I like, that I'm comfortable with, right? So that's what I'm going to show you here today. So right now, there's eight styles. I did. I put up ten. Eight styles that I like to do. That's very simple. Okay. So we about to move on to the hill. Okay, you guys. So this is the first hairstyle. It's a pony. I know y'all seen this a lot the most. Wait, I forgot to do my edges for you guys. Hold up. Okay, I'm back. You know, now the edges make it look a little cleaner. Like, see, you still see the gel, like, it's drying, but yeah, you know. So, this is the first one. Num, new widow. No. So, this is my fake go to because, you know, when you do updos, like, it cleans up your face. Like, see, you see my smile better. Working on my winkle, but. It's nice. So now we're gonna do number two. It's basically another pony, just with bangs. Like, I'm gonna show you two ways to do the bangs. You could do three, but that's not me. It might be you, but it's not me. So I'm gonna just still show you anyway, all right? So now on to number two. Okay, so this is how I do my bangs. I like to do, you know, just a little two switch it up a bit i like it like this and you see look i do the wrap around so that it hides the scrunchie because it's obviously red so if you do it in black you don't have to but like it just hides it to make it look neater in my opinion but and then you know you could whip it in people's face you know if you got to just but <laughs> That's my fave go-to. So now I'm going to show you the other way. It's not hard at all. I literally just take a few pieces and put it to the side. And then with that, I'm probably gonna show you how to do a swoop. I haven't done it in a while, so bear with me. All right, still a piece sticking. Okay, so this is the other way I wear it, you know, just like all to one side. So basically, I took the two from here, shift it over, and then like I twist it back so that way it could stay. So now, if you want to do a swoop from here, you can, but I suggest using more pieces. So I have four right here. Probably use like a good six, seven, probably eight. I, I just like even, even numbers, but even four could work. So you see what I did there? Let's just bring it around. So basically like, so this piece, these that's left you would just stick it in your scrunchie you will have to use a pin though but like you're gonna use a pin and then you're just gonna bring it up and that's it i just don't like it so that's why i didn't do it so those are my first two styles with the pony all right so now we're gonna go to style number three it's gonna be mad, like, it's mad simple. Like, everyone does it. I mean, it's a lot because this is long. These are the extra long soft locks, so this goes past my butt. I will show y'all that, how long it is. But, yeah, we're gonna keep it up right now. I like it up like this. And then look, with the side part, you see how the edge swoop look? And then, mm, picture perfect. Look at those teeth. All right. So now, on to style number three. OK, 
Okay, so this is stat number three. So it's a bun. That's why I said it's not simple. Like, who doesn't do a bun with braids or anything? So yeah, this is my bun. I try to make this one look as neat as possible because sometimes I don't like leaving it neat, but you don't want to sneak. Once again, the edges, it helps. Oh, so yeah, this is style number three. So basically, it's like what I did before with the pony. I'm gonna do a bun with the bang, and I'm gonna do a messy bun. My messy buns are my favorite when I go because you know it has a little aesthetic to it, where it looks very eccentric, and I'm just like, hold on, side. No. I don't remember which side is my side, but we're gonna say both. I'm gonna say this side because you know my beauty mark show, so you know, ow, we're gonna do that. So, yeah, that's what we're gonna do. So, let me just show you real quick a little one, two. Okay, so it looks like every time I finish this thing, it's going to stick out just a bit, and then I have to fix. Here it is a two in the front. So I am gonna show y'all the same way how I did it before, you know, just bring it over. You know what, I ain't even gonna take it down and do all of that. Cause the two looks cute too. And it looks like it's nothing, but you know, we got a few more pieces, but this is like, not cute. I'm not gonna lie, I didn't even do the style like that. I wish I did. Oh well, RIP to these dreads. When I take them out, I mess my hair. Cause woo! You see all that? That's bare new growth. But, ew. All right, so I'm gonna show y'all. It's the messy bun. It it's, looks kind of neat, but messy at the same time. So, you, you get what I mean, right? All right, y'all see it though, y'all gonna see it. So basically, I don't take my time doing it. I just wrap it around however. So this one looks to me look more like a nest because you know, when birds make nests, it's not neat. They just, they just make it. So for me, I look like that, you know, where it sticks out a bit. This one was killing me because like, what am I gonna do with that? So you know, just thing. But now you see what I see my, my, my side of you, hold on. I wish something came out on this side, but they all actually wanted to go talk about This is my messy bun. So, yeah. I'm really in love with my edges. I forgot that them, but. I said I forgot that them. I forgot to do them at first, but I just make a difference. This I can't control. I mean, it curled up. But. So that was five styles I just did. You know, one being the pony, two, pony with bang, three, bun, four, bun with bang. Now this one, messy. Don't look that messy, but y'all get the gist. So now we're gonna move on to six. Oh, I'm gonna do next for you guys. Hmm, what should I do? I don't think of which one would be less work to do first to lead to that one. Hmm. Got it. So I'm gonna do a swoop, but with it out. So it's gonna be a side part. And a swoop. Let go. So basically, that's like a easy way I do because, like you see, the part is clean, not as clean as if it was fresh. But you see what I mean? Like, when you put the scrunchie back there, it holds it in place so it's not going all over. You don't have to keep worrying about tucking and going like that. So, you know, I just did it with a scrunchie because it holds easier. And then look, look how nice it just holds and it looks neat. You see, like, the side part? I just, I love side parts. 
But yeah, like, you see? This is mad simple. Y'all wanna see how long this is? Like, Y'all yeah, gotta bear with me because, you know, I got no shorts. So, like, oh. So, like, you see? This is how long they are. If it goes past my butt. But. Oh. I'm sorry I had to see that. Oh, the jiggle. But yeah. So yeah, this is it. Long hair, don't care. Oh, oh, oh. Alright, so now this was the sixth style. Now we're gonna get ready for seven. You know, seven is my birthday month. So that's the only reason why I like that number. But other than that, even numbers. But anyways, seven. I did a half up, half down pony. Uh, uh, uh. So yeah, I do the wrap around here because you don't want to see the screen sheet. And instead of me fully going around and around, I ran, I stop when it's like two, three times and I just tuck it in very, very good. I don't use pins because like the pins hurt my head last time I did it, which was years ago. But I learned not to use pins and just make it work by tucking, you know, and now half up half down you know you could do it like this all right have some in the front rest of it in the back so this is what it looked like oh wait yeah oh still cute you know you can style these things i don't know who said you gotta look boring nah not over here. Alright, so now we're going on to style number eight. Eight. That's my I feel weird. Eight. That's what we're gonna do. Eight, which is the last and final style. It's still gonna be in this concept though. But and and Okay, so this is my last and final style. Yeah, like, I mean, I actually did the bun so nice because last time I did it, I hated it. But right now, I love it. So, yeah. Mm. You know, you could bring a little bit to the front again. But then again, it looked weird like that. So, yeah. Ooh, you're so good. So, we're going to keep it like this, you know? Yeah. So these were my eight styles. Let me know which one was your fave, you know? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let me know. I mean, this one kind of feeling it though. Kind of feeling it. Yeah, yeah. All right, you guys. So that's it for today. And this is the last time y'all are gonna see these locks. I don't know when I'm gonna do it again. I don't know if I'm gonna do passion twists or not list box braids. I'm done. Cause like they're so pretty like i haven't done locks in forever it's always been wigs natural wigs natural nigs natural so we're gonna switch it up a bit and yeah so i hope y'all liked it let me know what y'all think you know please continue to subscribe like comment let me know what y'all want to see i appreciate it so y'all already know what i'm gonna say shea bugs man Shea Bugs is 